A special tribute in Midwest City today for a life lost way too soon. Friends, family, and the Rose State College community remembering R.J. Long. He's the Rose State student and Marine shot to death on campus last year, but his family says, first and foremost, he's their hero. News 4's John Hayes joins us in studio with more on that special tribute. John. Jolene, it's certainly been a tough year for the Long family. RJ's accused killer awaiting trial today, though, about making sure his legacy is a permanent fixture on campus. I know beyond a shadow of a doubt where he is, and he's in heaven. A moment of reflection Friday for Kelly Long, her family, friends, and the Rose State community honoring her son, RJ. That's RJ. That's my son. That's my hero. McIntyre Law Chopper 4 over the scene that fateful April afternoon last year when Rose State warned everyone on campus to shelter in place. Brandon Morissette is facing a murder charge for shooting RJ that day. He was on his knees with his hands raised up saying, I surrender, I surrender. And people were saying, point name, he shot that guy. His wife telling police he believed she and Long classmates were having an affair. Friends and witnesses told police Long died while trying to keep her safe. Yes, we're proud of RJ. Long says she's also proud of his faith, a new permanent brick on the Rose State campus paying tribute to that. And he was very special to the students and the faculty. Speaking to love and his willingness to lay his life down for his friends. He was on the go, living his life to the fullest. And because of that, and because of who he is on the inside, everywhere I go, I get to see a bit of RJ, wherever I go. And we love him, we miss him, but we know we're going to see him soon. As for Morissette, court records say his trial is set to start in October. We will, of course, be following that.